Six YouTubers Hidden in Video Games. Before we begin, leave a like and subscribe for a week of good luck. Hey, what's up guys? Chamelo back for a brand new video. Now in today's video, we are going to be taking a look at six YouTubers hidden in video games. Now this video is going to be crazy, so be sure to watch the entire video as you don't want to miss out on seeing some of your favorite YouTubers such as Unspeakable, Latchlin, Ninja, Dan the Diamond Minecart, and more. But anyways, let's check it out. Number 6, Latlin Skin in Fortnite. Many of you might not know about this one, but Fortnite actually put a YouTuber skin in their game. Fortnite is well known for including outfits based off of real life characters. Most of the time, they keep it fairly subtle, and that appears to be the case for this skin. Latchlin actually posted a video talking about the skin, and from the video, it looks pretty similar to Latchlin himself. The skin is called The Verge, and it includes a guy with goggles and a hazard suit. But what Latchlin points out is that the skin is wearing a sweatshirt that appears to be an exact copy of one of Latchlin's recent merch drops. While it's not 100% confirmed that this skin is supposed to be Latchlin, it is definitely a possibility considering the character looks like him and the outfit is similar to one of Latchlin's merch hoodies. But anyway, check out this clip and let us know what you think in the comments down below. Uh, you guys know there's a couple skins in the game that kind of look like me. We got the Drift. As you guys know, I did a cosplay of it. Here's a few photos from that. I mean, next up, we got the Elf. It doesn't really look like me, but it's just like my kind of main skin that I've been using the last couple months. Uh, but then, came out with a new skin, and I originally saw it on the data mine, and I was like, wait, what the hell? Uh, and that skin is none other than the Verge skin. So this is the skin close up, and uh, originally I saw, and a lot of you guys on Twitter saw, the uh, kind of resemblance that it has to one of the merch uh, designs I did a while ago. It's this one actually I'm wearing right now. It's the Hazard hoodie, we called it. And uh, it has my logo, the bolt, around a yellow, uh, like, triangle blank warning sign kind of thing. Hazard, right? Uh, if you have a look at his, you know, logo he's got on his chest and on his arm, he's got a yellow triangle with a bolt in it. Now, that is also the logo, I believe, of, like, Save the World Storm Shield. Number five, Dan the Diamond Minecart in Minecraft. We have the one and only Dan TDM. In this clip, Dan is playing some Minecraft when he actually spots a picture of himself on a wall in the game. This is super cool as he is inside such a popular game that everybody knows about. But not only this, Dan is also featured as a character in the game. He even does the voiceover and they mention his full name. This is insane and awesome that a Minecraft YouTuber was featured in the game. But anyway, check out this clip of Dan the Diamond Minecart reacting to himself in Minecraft. Hey, this is so creepy. About? Yours looks just like you. Oh geez. This is so ridiculously creepy. Right? At first I was like, Oh, cool, fan art, flattering. But the yeah. more I thought about it, creepy is definitely right. Oh, look. Well, that's definitely not a good sign. He's been oh, bumped everyone. off. Oh, let's huddle up in the dining room. Wonder if he told them yet. Ah. Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. That's me. <laughs> oh my goodness. This is so weird. Ooh, I hope there's cake. Yeah, that's stampy. Yeah, it's not. Oh, Go on, man. let's do this. Oh, what's going on? <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> YouTube is in Minecraft story mode. Who knew? Oh, my hair's changed. It's changed to blue. Here, let me introduce you all properly. Number four, Unspeakable hidden in a video game. Unspeakable also has a video game which was made about him. The game is called Chasecraft, and it's a classic three lanes runner game with craft mechanics and swipe character control. The game's settings and locations are familiar to players from the legendary Minecraft. As you are most likely aware, Unspeakable is a huge Minecraft fan, so the Minecraft aspect makes this game perfect for him. Basically, the game is structured as follows. The player runs through five locations to mine resources and craft various materials. The materials are needed to construct the player's home destroyed by evil creatures, bosses who inhabit every location. One of those bosses is involved in a kidnapping of Unspeakable, so the player has to not only rebuild the home, but also rescue his or her favorite YouTuber. Honestly, such a cool concept, and the fact that it's all based around a popular YouTuber is even more awesome. Here's some footage of Unspeakable playing his very own Chasecraft. It's free. It's 
Free, 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 free. Once you get on the Chasecraft app, there's a whole entire new section right here. And this is, well, well, we can't go here yet because we got to build a cableway. And how many resources is this? Oh, I actually have enough resources. It takes one hour to build, but I'm going to go ahead and finish it now because I got to show you guys this now. Like this is, this is huge. So we built a cableway and now we have this whole entire island unlocked. Check this out. Yeti Island, winter challenge, run as far as possible. If you go to the Yeti Island, which doesn't take that many resources, to, to get to. You really just need gold, bricks, and wood, which isn't that much. But once you make it over there, there's actually a challenge on the Yeti Island yet. There's also snowboards stuck in the ground. And oh, there's moving penguins. That's legit. Oh my gosh. Hey, buddies. Just uh, stay still for me. There we go. Okay. So far, I've only ran a hundred meters. Number three, Corey Kenshin video game. Next up, we have an entire video game that is dedicated to the YouTuber known as Cory Kenshin. The game is titled Better to Upload, and it's pretty much a joke pertaining to Cory's hiatus on YouTube that he took a couple years back. The game is set up like a horror game, and Cory is the monster in which players must find. Honestly, it seems like a pretty scary game to play, even though it is meant as a joke. Cory uploaded a video when the game dropped and seemed to enjoy it in his video. The game is based off the popular horror game Five Nights at Freddy's, except, well, you're walking through and spending the nights in Cory's house. Anyway, check out this clip from Cory's video showcasing his own video game. Letters to hack the bot. Type what letters? I R. R Y R C C O C C O O Y Y C C O. How how much do I gotta do this? Y C R. Those were my letters in my name. Hello, my friend. It seems I have awakened. This is me. I can freeze like that's me. I feel so good. Blue really suits me. I'm glad they gave me this body. Thank you for activating me. Please. Number two, Ninja Fortnite skin. This one is a bit less hidden as compared to the previous skin, but Ninja actually has a skin of his own on Fortnite. The skin was released in January of this year, and Ninja was able to preview it before the outfit officially came out. As you all know, Ninja is most likely the most popular Fortnite player of all time, so it's awesome that Epic Games would make a skin dedicated to him. The skin is called Ninja, and is a recreation of Ninja wearing a blue suit and a yellow bandana, his favorite outfit. Ninja was so excited to have his own skin in Fortnite, and it was definitely a great move on Epic Games' part. I wonder if any other YouTubers are going to be added to the Fortnite skin collection. But anyway, check out this clip of Ninja showcasing his own Fortnite skin. Uh, Alright, might not be here yet. Oh! Oh my god! What? Bro, look at that. It looks just like me! Oh my god! What? What? Dude! Four different variations. Oh my god, bro. There's the bag playing, dude. Dual katanas, check. And number one, PewDiePie mobile game. PewDiePie is hidden in a mobile video game called What It's Like to Be a YouTuber. Basically, as the title explains, in this game, you are able to step inside the shoes of a viral YouTuber as you create content for millions of viewers. So it's honestly like being a YouTuber yourself. Well, as you all know, PewDiePie is one of the most famous and most subscribed YouTubers of all time, so it was only right to put him inside the game. PewDiePie's character was made very well, and it actually looks almost identical to him. This game was a great idea, and it kind of shows you what it's like to make YouTube content and become a part of the YouTube world as your videos go viral. But anyway, check out this clip from PewDiePie playing as himself in What It's Like to Be a YouTuber. Yeah, Outer Minds, the developers, if they could help me, but no, it's super easy. Dude, I gained 7 million views when I was away. What is this? Pathetic. God damn it, this is my room, it's so ugly. <laughs> Should we try and recreate the setup I have here? So I'm level 47. Let's see, have I been kicked out of the guild I was part of? That it now that we're all equipped with high-tech gadgets, 
I haven't heard myself. You get to building the best possible sci-fi environment. Good. And because infinite worlds exist in a sci-fi context. Oh. Imagine how many different rooms this special event will host. I can't imagine. Anyways, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to leave a like and subscribe with notifications turned on. Also check out some of my other videos as you don't want to miss these.